here. I'll give you read to you what it says here on this card. On your anniversary, Father, a life that is dedicated to the service of the Lord is a beautiful example of a living, loving faith. You live your faith and help us to live ours through sermons, lessons, and counseling. Everything you do in God's presence, you remind us that He is a loving, forgiving God. That's why we celebrate not only your day, but also every blessing you brought us. So God's blessing on your 35th year. I don't know, Father Kavajal wants to say hey. I don't know if that's crazy, but you know how I am. I do that. Yeah. And this is overwhelming for me because I told people I have, 35 isn't anything. 25, 40, 40, you get to have, um, uh, be a consultant at the mass as a bishop, you know, all kinds of things like that. But 35, I didn't think there was anything, any, any big thing. But I had celebrations for three weeks now. <laughs> you can't hear me? No. It's like mass. <laughs> Everybody says they can't hear me at mass. <laughs> All right. Does everybody hear me now? Yeah. All right. One of the things I, I'm amazed at is that um, they started saying, oh, we're going to have a, a, the, the, the um, a women's club over here at St. Mary's and one at St. Tom, uh, St. Joseph's are going to get together for a potluck for you. Okay, that's fine. I love the potlucks. But then they started, well, in the bulletin it said, Everybody in the parish is, is welcome. And then I saw some people passing out envelopes. And then I heard people announcing that this is going to be a wonderful thing. And everybody said, oh, we're happy we're going to be there. And I'll, I said, this isn't any big thing. <laughs> but look at all you. This is a big thing. Yeah. <laughs> You know what's beautiful about this is that the parishes are together, the different cultures are together. Yes. We are one family. Yes. Yes. And that's what we're all working for, mm -hmm. Father and I. Are, that's what we're here working for, huh? Mm -hmm. And you're responding. You get it. <laughs> you get it. Yeah. And I, I'm grateful to you. So very grateful to you. And then they tell me here that this is the picture of what you're going to get. So this is a, I don't know if I should tell you this. Um, last year, I, I saw this in the catalog and I said, gee, this would be nice. For a celebration of Our Lady of Guadalupe, this vestment for uh, celebrating Our Lady of Guadalupe. That's um, and then I said to somebody, gee, that would be nice that I could use it in the casket. I could be buried with her. People said, don't tell anybody about that. But it's so beautiful. I don't want to let it go. And um, it is a real tribute. And I am so grateful. Um, it's even better than the chalice. Because I have chalices. But this one is unique. And it is a tribute to Our Lady. And it's a tribute to the ministry that we all serve, huh? And I am so grateful to all of you. Thank you so much. Thank you.
Uh, Father Camacho, it's been 35 years, and I gotta admit, I was very, very impressed with the turnout. Yes, so uh, was I. Do you have any wonderful. thoughts? I'm overwhelmed at the not only the turnout but the the atmosphere. It was very joyful, and and the unity, uh, not only in the two parishes but in in everybody that was here. The different cultures, the the different um, walks of life. That's what church is, and I am so grateful to the Lord that everybody participated and the food it was amazing um, but the, the camaraderie the friendship the fellowship was really overwhelming and I'm grateful to the Lord for that and to the people thank you thank you father and we're, we're grateful to you for your service to the community and to to our Lord thank you God Pray bless you me. father Pray for me we will father okay God bless you and you too God bless you